I'm Dan Lieberman, Professor of Human Evolutionary Biology, and I have the privilege of teaching SLS 16, Human Evolution in the Human Body. Do you ever wonder why the human body is so unusual? Why you walk on two legs? Why your brain is so big? Why you have no snout? Why you sweat? Do you ever wonder why humans are so good at throwing? Why we are so good at running long distances and at making tools? Do you ever wonder about our many behavioral peculiarities? For example, why do we humans cooperate so much with each other? Why do we always eat cooked foods? And why do we commit acts of both altruism and violence? And finally, do you ever wonder about all the major problems that we face today in their evolutionary history? We face an epidemic of obesity which afflicts about 25% of children and about a third of adults. Many of us get heart disease and cancer, as well as bad backs, fallen arches, and rotten teeth. Why do these diseases never occur among hunter-gatherers? The answers to these and other important questions lie in our evolutionary history. We are apes, but very specialized apes who diverged from the chimpanzee lineage about six million years ago. In SLS 16, we will explore what initially set us off on a separate evolutionary trajectory from our closest relatives, the chimpanzees, and then consider other major transformations that took place since that fateful divergence. In particular, we'll look at the first hominids. We'll look at Australopiths, such as Lucy, and the origins of the human genus, and the origins of hunting and gathering. We'll look at the evolution of big-brained, archaic humans, such as Neanderthals, and at the origins of our own species, Homo sapiens. Understanding these ancient events is essential to understanding how and why the human body is the way it is. But human evolution didn't stop suddenly 200,000 years ago. Since then, we've dispersed across the whole world, we've invented agriculture, and then we engineered the Industrial Revolution. So the final portion of this class examines the relationship between the bodies that we inherited and the world we have recently created for ourselves. We'll ask how the mismatch between our hunter-gatherer bodies and our 21st century lives are the cause of problems such as the obesity epidemic, of problems such as population growth and global climate change. So if you'd like to learn more about how evolution works, how it made you the way you are, how we can use evolution to address many serious problems that we confront today, then consider taking SLS 16, Human Evolution and the Human Body.